Dear colleagues, this is a new mix procedure that I came up with. It's basically at the end of the phaco surgery, we can go across the cornea from the lower temporal quadrant on the opposite side to the nasal upper quadrant where we know that are more than 60% uh, of the collector channels and to do a sclerectomy, ab internal sclerectomy using a needle. In this case I use a 21 gauge needle. This uh, patient have a glaucoma before uh, cataract surgery. Up, the IOP was uh, on uh, like 30, 28, 30 millimeter mercury. And you can see that I use the needle to go into the space, into the trabecular meshwork, in the space of uh, in between cornea and um, iris, and pushing and turning the needle, I create a tunnel, not just a cut, but a tunnel. By rotating that needle, you create a tunnel going from the anterior chamber down uh, to the um, subconscious space. In this case uh, we're gonna see the tip of the needle that's run right underneath the tenon uh, space. You can see it turning. You can uh, go underneath the subtenon uh, area or you can go above tenon and uh, that's up to you depending on where you inject the BSS or the anesthesia before you raise the conch. So uh, first case was the left eye done with the left hand. The second case is the right eye. Uh, the main uh, the anterior chamber was maintained with uh, viscoelastic in the first case and this second case is on uh, BSS underneath the AC maintainer and in this case the needle this is a 23 gauge needle a little smaller one because the the IOP in this case it's uh, around 24 millimeter mercury. In this case uh, the needle is going above the subtenon space. And uh, the last case again um, will be under uh, viscoelastic done. Again after cataract surgery from the um, lower temporal quadrant going across uh, and um, into the subconscious space. In this case we will form a bleb. This is a sclerectomy that is done by this uh, needle passing through the trabecular meshwork, passing to the sclera and you notice the fact that in this passage you always turning the needle so you can create a tunnel not just a cut. So creating a tunnel will uh, ensure that uh, the aqueous humor will flow underneath the conjunctiva you'll have a bleb and uh, if you instruct the patient a uh, couple of weeks after the surgery to do a ocular massage that will uh, ensure the patency of that uh, sclerectomy and will keep it open as much as the patient will uh, do the massage. Thank you for your attention. Let me know if your uh, thoughts on this new procedure.